Dylan, good to see you again. Congrats on the Batman. Thank you. It's great being here. Have you seen it yet? I've seen it a couple times. <laughs> Man, so I want to hear about the start of this journey because the Batman, like, I remember five, six years ago, this was like a Ben Affleck five, movie. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, and five. then it transformed into Matt took over. Now we have Pattinson. We're finally here. When did this shred of an idea first come to life for you guys? This was about, two, about five years ago. Uh, Matt came up with a pitch. And then we went on a journey to get a script written, and then we found this great Batman. And that, w then Rob's been with us for three years, and then two years of making the movie. So it's been, you, you know, I've never worked on a movie every day for five years, so uh, it's, been, it's been an intense journey, but one that I'm, I, I feel so much gratitude for and I, and I love. Oh, dude, you guys crushed it. And I, I mean, we know this is based on the long Halloween. On the flight up here today, I was reading Hush. Like, it really, there's so many Batman comics from, and video games, and other movies, just elements of things that come into this while it's still totally fresh. Like, how did you guys kind of look at everything that had been done before in every medium and say, we want to tell, like, the definitive Batman story with this one? I think Matt wanted to do something personal. He wanted to put Batman in the center of something that we hadn't seen him do. He went on a deep dive with all these comics. You, re you reference Hush and Long Halloween. Jeff Loeb, who wrote Long Halloween, taught Matt how to write screenplays at USC. Frank Miller, of course, year one was you know super important to us. Um, you know, but really it was about putting Robert at the cent of a at the center of a story and and just rocking him to his core. And, and we get the Riddler as the first villain for this introductory story. Are there Batman is known for his rogues gallery? Any characters who you guys really are like? Maybe that one would be fun if we get to it. Along the way, of course, we meet Selena Kyle, who's going to turn into Catwoman, and Oz is there, who is going to become you know P Penguin and the, the Kingpin at some point. We hope. That's right. And you mentioned Oz. I mean, like I know we we've heard about various spinoffs and stuff. When these universes start to develop, and this is the start of a new one, do you guys stay involved with everything? Is there different teams looking at everything? Is it constant collaboration? We're we're focused on this one Batman working. We want this thing to we're, look. We're here. We're excited for the world to see this thing. It opened in Korea yesterday or today. Um, this is about getting this one done right, yeah. and then uh, hopefully we're lucky enough to do another one. And you and Matt have been partners on plenty of films before this one. I love all of them. You got especially coming off the Apes movies. Huge fan of those. What sort of things did this like the Batman did it challenge you in new ways is it the expectations from fans that are different like what kind of stuff went into it that didn't go into anything you did before yeah 80 years of Batman just puts <laughs> a heavy pressure on anybody and you know you have to be ambitious when you take a swing on this kind of movie there's all these great directors that have come before you and these great Batman you got Snyder you got Nolan you got Ben you got uh, Bale you know Keaton um, it's it's intimidating it's daunting there's moments of terror but then you got to just put it behind Behind you and just swing for the fences and so that's what we tried to do we I, re I respect the respect you have for all the okay. previous iterations and my last thing for you say this is a huge success which I think it is going to be Warner really says we want another one this one took five years how long does it take to make a second movie that that lives up to this quality again I will go on record saying that it will be less than five years <laughs>